Hi, Aaron. Hi. Okay, so I'm gonna give you some actions to do. Just do the first thing that comes to your mind. Your wife just cheated on you. Show me what it looks like to take it like a man. Okay. Your grandma just died. Take it like a man. Grandma dead. I don't care. Surprised she lasted this long. My name is Ernest and I am 48 years old. Your wife just cheated on you. Show me what it looks like to take it like a man. Take your grandma dying like a man. Anna! Grandma. I fucked you long when you asked me. Take me. It's dead. Fight like a man. Whoa. Here, take my wallet. I don't believe in violence. I guess I'd kick him in the dick. What does it mean to you when I say, take your wife cheating on you like a man? It means everything I love in life is over. So do you think you just insulted your husband? No. I mean, men, I insulted men, not my husband. Is like a man a good thing? I don't actually know what it really, if it's a bad thing or a good thing. It sounds like a bad thing, like someone's trying to tell you not to feel. So when they're in that vulnerable time between 40 and 50, how do you think it affects them when someone uses like a man as a way to say, don't show me how you really feel? I think it definitely drops their self-confidence and really puts them down because like, they're already trying to figure themselves out during that time. And like when someone says, take it like a man, like, what does that even mean? Because they think they're a strong person and it's kind of like telling them they're weak or not as good as them. And what advice do you have to middle-aged men who were told, take your wife cheating on you like a man, your favorite football team losing like a man, not being able to procreate anymore like a man? Keep taking it like you really would, because it's working. If somebody tells you that taking a death like a man, or a breakup like a man, or a loss to your home team like a man is something that you should be doing, that's their problem. Because if you're still crying, if you're still kicking that lying whore out of your house, if you're still tweeting pro athletes that you were better than them in high school, you're doing it right. It doesn't matter what they say. I mean, yes, I cry like a man, and I scream insane profanities like a man, and I tweet like a man, and I wake up in the morning like a man because I am a man, and that is not something that I should be ashamed of. So I'm gonna do it anyway. That's what they should do. If I asked you to take your wife cheating on you like a man now, would you do it any differently? I would tell that bitch off like myself. Would you like a chance to redo it? Yeah. Why can't getting cheated on and taking it like a man also mean kicking that other guy's ass while you're crying. Oh, hell no!